welcome again to my video. Today, we're going to talk about the different kinds of fraction. Now, so we have three different kinds of fraction. Yes, we have three different kinds of fraction. The common one, or the first one, is what we call proper fraction. Okay? When we say proper fraction, it means, or I will just make it a, uh, a simple way. When we say proper fraction, it means the numerator is less than denominator. As simple as that. So again, let's uh, read. Proper fraction, the numerator is less than denominator. So when we say or an example of this are one half, what else? So we can have four ninth or let's say 57, um, 98, okay, 57, 98 or uh, Sometimes I let my student to call this one 57 over 98, okay? Next, number two. So if we have proper fraction, we have also improper, yes, improper fraction. In improper fraction, the numerator, the numerator, is more than the numerator is more than denominator okay so we have uh, improper fraction the numerator is more than denominator or sometimes they make it as more than or equal to denominator Okay, now let's talk about this. So, for example, we have what? Um, let's say 4 third. Yeah, the number on the top is bigger than the number uh, the bottom. Okay, so the numerator is more than denominator. Another one, we can have 7 7. They are the same. It's, it is also called as improper fraction. And actually, this one has its own name. Later, I am going to talk about that. So, we have what? 27 over 8 or 27, 8. Okay? So, we have proper fraction and improper fraction. Let's talk about another kind of uh, fraction. Third one is what we call mixed fraction. Okay, this one is what we call mixed fraction. So when we say mixed fraction or combined fraction in other book, combined fraction or mixed fraction, this one represents as a combination of a whole number and a uh, proper fraction combination of a whole number and a proper fraction let uh for example now i have a whole number here which is two and i have a fraction for example three seven so this one what kind of fraction it should be it should be proper fraction why because the numerator must be less than to the denominator so i will give another one so we have one and one fifth right or it can be three and seven eleven or seven eleven okay so in number four this is the special fraction and this one is what we call whole fraction okay so whole fraction so when we say whole fraction it means the the numerator 
is equal to denominator. Okay. So it is look like what? Look like an improper fraction. So we have four fourths. So it's equal to one. Right? Or one whole. Or it can be 50 over 50. Or 50 50. Yet. Is the same as one. Okay? Four fourths is the same as one. 50 50 yet is the same as one. Okay. Let's make a uh, number line about fraction so that one whole fraction um, sometimes not really specified in the kinds of fraction so I usually have three kinds okay so let's try this so kinds of fraction so if we are going to draw a number line in fraction this one is to show the kinds of fraction so this is represent as one full and I am going to draw different parts okay different parts uh, I will make it big so this one one and here two so as you can see in number line okay in number line it represent always to zero so from zero to one it can cut how many you want okay but for me I will cut into this part so this one I will cut so from this to this it represent as one fourth okay from this to this it will represent as two fourths this to this it represent as three fourths and one is represent as four fourths okay so from this one up to this one or before that or let's say here okay this one represent as proper fraction okay so the four fourths here, it represent as one or a one whole. This one represent as whole, okay? Whole uh, number or whole fraction. And then from this one up to this, okay? Up to there. This one represent as improper fraction. Why improper? Because it will represent as what? 5 fourths, 6 fourths, 7 fourths, and then 8 fourths. Yeah. Improper fraction means the numerator is bigger than the denominator, which is 4. Yeah. That one is what we call improper. But some part, they usually write as what? 1 and 1 fourth. They will just come back to one fourth, two fourths, three fourths. But they will use the one whole. So one and one fourth, one and two fourths, one and three fourths, and two. Okay? These are represent as mix. Why mix? Because you combine the one whole here, and this one represent as one four, two four, three four, and then four fourths again. Okay, so we have different kinds of fraction, and I hope you understand the difference of each other. Okay, Always remember, practice makes perfect. Thank you so much for your listening. I hope you enjoyed this video and please share it to your friend. Thank you.